Hey, how's it going, guys? Sean, next time back with another review. Today, I'm bringing you just a quick um, update of what I'm going to be doing during WrestleMania 31 weekend. Uh, I just have like a list here. I'm just going to tell you um, like my plans and like my uh, what we're going to be doing. Me and my uh, dad while we're down there. Definitely going to be recording for you guys just like last year, so don't you worry. Um, and yeah, so let me just go down this list, and um, I'll probably be back maybe what's next week sometime for my WrestleMania 31 uh, predictions. And maybe like one more video talking about maybe like, um, what was I going to do? Maybe what, like what I'm bringing to WrestleMania, maybe, I don't know, but we'll see. And then it's, guys, WrestleMania is games just like that. I'm looking forward to it, I'm so pumped for it. Um, the uh, IC title ladder match should be awesome. Just the whole weekend in general is going to be epic. So, um, but that's not the but that's not, uh, this video, but let me just tell you what I'm going to be doing during, uh. WrestleMania 31 uh, weekend plans or trip. So Thursday we're gonna arrive in um, California. Obviously we're just gonna you know uh, uh, Thursday's really just gonna be uh, you know whatever day. Uh, just get there, get situated, you know all that stuff. Um, Thursday I go to school and then, then my parents are gonna take me out like a little bit early just to so we can beat like the traffic if there is any. And then after we arrive we're probably just gonna go to dinner and like relax for that for the night and then. We can get started Friday, like on like what we need to do and what we're gonna do. So like Thursday is just like a get there, and relax after the long flight and all that. So Friday is where we started off. We're probably just gonna go breakfast in the morning. Then after that, we might tour a little bit, like tour uh, in the morning most likely because um, this just happened. We like I didn't even think about it, but I asked my dad if we could go uh, meet him at WrestleCon. And we're gonna go meet uh, Rey Mysterio at WrestleCon on Friday, so that's really cool. Um, Rey Mysterio is one of the guys that I've never met so far, so that's a thing to check off my bucket list. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, so I think the I think the Rey Mysterio signing is anywhere between twelve and four, so we can go whenever we want. But I I probably want to get it. I don't know if I want to get it over with like around like earlier in the day or later in the day, but. Um, well, we don't know yet, and also we have an access session from 6 to 10 that night, meeting John Cena and Triple H, so we need to, we'll probably figure out some some schedule. And we're not going to follow this exact schedule, probably not, but like, like the, the major things, we'll obviously be going to follow, but like the minor things, we might like switch up a little, and like maybe on Saturday we might go tour instead, but you get the gist. And like I said, access session at 6 to 10, meeting John Cena and Triple H, which is going to be awesome. John Cena I met last year, but meeting them again is just going to be even better. I'm going to get him to sign the WrestleMania 28 poster because that's going to look sick with his autograph on there. And for Triple H, I bought like um, I bought a picture like just like this one, uh, the John Cena one. It's a 20 by 16 for Triple H, though, so that's going to be really cool to have him sign. So now we move on to Saturday. Uh, we're probably going to go to the Superstore maybe on Saturday. I don't know. Is my head in this shot? I don't know. Whatever. Um, oh, my God. I, have to, I feel like I have to sneeze. <coughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> All right. Saturday, we're probably going to go to the Superstore. Um, definitely want to go buy some maybe uh, some shirts and some merchandise and stuff, you know, just to uh, have as like a, you know, um, definitely some shirts though. I would definitely want to buy some shirts. Then on from one to five, we have another access session. Um, oh my god, I feel like I have to sneeze again. But then we're gonna meet Randy Orton. Sorry, this is there's your humor in this video. Uh, anyways, uh, one to five access session. We're gonna meet Randy Orton, another person that I haven't met yet. Definitely want to check him on my bucket list, which is gonna be awesome. Randy Orton is probably like the guy that I wanted to meet the most. Hey, him and Triple H definitely the, the two biggest. And Undertaker, I've never met Undertaker. That's like one up there too. I'd probably say Triple H, Randy Orton, Undertaker, The Rock, and like Stone Cold are like the five that I want to meet the most. That would be just amazing to me. And then we're gonna do the access session from six to ten. We haven't bought like any VIP, any VIP for either Dean Ambrose or Seth Rollins, but we might buy a Seth Rollins. We don't know what, what's gonna happen yet, but uh, we're probably gonna be going to that session too. Not Hall of Fame. We I wanted to go to Hall of Fame, but this Hall of Fame class this year is just pretty bad. I'm like no no disrespect to any of the guys. They definitely deserve it in there. The only good ones that I really would care about is Macho Man and Rikishi, to be honest. But um, I don't really wanna. 
waste my time with like not waste my time but I don't want to like go watch I don't want to be there live for someone that for people that I really never grew up with and stuff like maybe in 10 years when John Cena gets inducted that'll be cool and like Triple H and because I grew up with them but Macho Man like no disrespect I mean he's a Hall of Famer definitely but I never really grew up with him and I can't like have that connection you know so um yeah so that's the only the reason why um but if like it was last year's I definitely wish I would have went to last year's because they had Paul Bearer I wish I really knew uh Lita Wait, was it Lita last year? Yeah, Lita. Um, uh, Ultimate Warrior, Jake the Snake, uh, Scott Hall. So th that was pretty cool. And then Sunday is obviously the big day, WrestleMania uh, 31. It's going to be awesome. And then that's it. And then we go home Monday, which is going to be uh, sad, but uh, just an amazing experience. I'm definitely going to be recording a lot, a lot of footage for you guys, so don't worry. Um, and I guess that's it. Um, maybe I'll check up with you guys later this week. Maybe I'll make a video, but if not, then I'll definitely have my WrestleMania 31 predictions up next week sometime after the whole card's finished, after they finished uh, the whole card and set everyone on the card. And then after that, um, it's WrestleMania season, maybe. I can't wait. It came up just like this. I say that every year, but um, yeah. So I hope you guys like this video. Please remember to follow me on Twitter at Deshaun Doesn't Rock. And um, if you guys didn't know, follow me on Instagram at DeshaunRocks10 and uh, add me on Snapchat at DeshaunRocks10. Um, and I guess that's it, guys. So uh, remember to rate, comment, subscribe. And uh, have a great day, guys. March Madness, too. It should be fun.